Ladies and Booettes, welcome back to my channel. I am makeup artist Charlie Allen. Today I will be doing a quick overview of how I keep my skin acne and blemish free. This will be the day by day and slash step by step process of this chemical peel, which is the Skin Suticles Acne Peel Plus which helps tame my acne and the blemishes on my face. So this peel is ideal for someone looking for a next level peel. Um, and it can be used to fight stubborn acne and provide a deeper exfoliation. These pictures are immediately after the peel. My face has started to frost, which gives it that whitish look across my face. That just lets me know that the peel did its job. It's soaking into the skin effectively. This is gonna turn out great. So the night of the peel and the very next morning, my face started to feel very tight, like dried out Saharan desert tight. Make sure you are carefully cleansing and moisturizing your skin properly after each peel. Make sure you're not using any products that have um, active ingredients or AHAs or anything that will burn the skin. For a face wash, I use the La Mousse face wash by Chanel. And I also use the La Mer soft cream and the Sunday Riley Juno antioxidant superfood oil. I also wanted to quickly add that I couldn't wash my face immediately after the chemical peel i had to let it dry for six hours okay, this is tuesday evening this would be fully day two but third day um and i'm starting to peel like crazy so this is what it's looking like mm. On a scale of one to 10, this chemical peel had to burn, um, I would say about a five. Um, it also tingled for about two to three hours after the peel. Let me know if you guys would like to see a skincare video routine for day and for night. Okay, this is Wednesday afternoon about two. PM. Yes, I am at work and this is where I'm at with the peeling. Look at that new skin under there. Ooh -wee. It's looking amazing. All the rest of this still has to peel. So let's get to it. I wouldn't recommend doing these chemical peels at home. Guys, do the right thing. Find a great esthetician that can perform this skin peel um, to your liking. Uh, don't burn yourselves at home. Don't overdo it or over process your skin. You'll regret it. So here we are on the fourth day. And as you can see, my face has peeled mostly all the way in the inside. Um, the peeling still have to take effect around the outer perimeter of my face, but it is looking good. Look at that new skin, y'all. Okay, guys, um, I am on Friday now. I got the pill on Sunday, so this is Friday morning or afternoon, about 1 p.m.-ish. Um, so this is how my skin looks. I still have a little bit more peeling to do on my forehead and around the outer perimeter of my face, but my face is looking amazing. What do you think? It looks great, right? So I'm so excited with the results. Um, hasn't even been a full week yet and my skin is, um, this would be the point where you can be ready for makeup or not at all. I'm not gonna put any makeup on. I'm just gonna continue with my skincare. Right now, look at this skin, y'all. It is looking amazing. Go Jesus, go Jesus, go Jesus. I mean, skin is on point. Yes, um, if you've ever been thinking about getting a pill, I would highly recommend this one. Um, look it up, do your research, make sure your skin is ready for it. 
Thank you for watching my channel. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. Have a good day, guys.